Hello and welcome to another Cosmic Noodles speed painting on my journey to become a better artist. Today I was playing around with different shading techniques, trying to figure out how to get a realistic pencil style of shading in Manga Studio 5. And one of the best ways of practicing that is by drawing a sphere spheres, um, the way that light and shadows hit them is a good way to practice that. So here I was trying to do some hatching and cross hatching to get different contrast and values on the sphere. And with spheres there's darker shadows in the middle and there's the point of light coming from the top left that hits the sphere and that little bounce light on the bottom and it's darkest in the middle and I was trying to use hatching and cross hatching to get those values correct and then of course there's the shadow <coughs> which ended up making a little too dark right here then I went around and tried to clean it up I tried to lighten up the shadow there that didn't really work out how I wanted it to, so I went and grabbed the blur tool and tried to blur the shadow in to see what kind of effect that had. So I ended up just blending it all in. And the blend tool seemed to have worked out pretty nicely. And I went and I feel like I should have left the cross hatching like that for the shadow. I thought that that looked pretty good. But I went ahead and Blended, used the blend tool and blended it all in anyways. Um, I was cleaning up the outsides of the sphere. Here, uh, I guess I'm using the blur tool on the inside of the sphere. And then I started using the paintbrush. So it's, uh, brushes by Ray Friendin, by the way. And then, yeah, I went back to the blending tool. And I thought that came out pretty nice. So I just pretty much just used the blend tool and kind of polished up the sphere and then added some reflection light. And yeah, that was about it. Well, that was that's it for this video. Thanks for watching.